Ryder, Ryder, what is it, Chase? I am starving. Can we get something to eat? Oh, yeah, that's a great idea. I'm hungry, too. You guys are right. Rescuing all day works up an appetite. My tummy just growled. I think we should get something to eat. Chase is on the case. I'm fired up. This pup's got to fly. Rubble on the double. Green means go. Let's dive in. Ice or snow, I'm ready to go. Wait for me, guys. Paw Patrol, it's time to eat. But what are we going to eat? I don't see any food. Guys, I think I could help. There's eight of you, and I happen to have... Eight delicious cupcakes. Wow, yummy. Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> well, well, well. What are you Paw Patrol doing? We were just about to eat some cupcakes. Would you like to share with us? Sharing's for good kids. I'm a bad kid. I want all the cupcakes. You can't have all the cupcakes because we're hungry too. If I can't have all the cupcakes, then nobody can have them. Take that. Have fun sharing. <laughs> Our cupcakes, they're ruined. That was so mean. Now we can't have any cupcakes. Don't worry, guys. I have an idea. Each of these cupcakes has its own shape. If we match the shapes together, maybe we can put them back together and then we can have our cupcakes. Hey, that's a good idea. Let's do it. It's Genevieve's Playhouse. <laughs> now all we have to do is match the cupcake tops to the cupcake bottoms and set them in the pan. Let's take a look at this one. What shape is that? It looks like a circle. So let's find the circle cupcake bottom. Look, they match. And we can slide them in like this. And this circle fits right here. Wow, this is going to be fun. Let's try another one. Let's see. This looks like a heart. Yeah, that's what it is. And here's the heart-shaped cupcake bottom. And it fits together just like a puzzle piece. And the heart fits right here. What shape is this one? It's triangle. That's right. It's a triangle. And here's a triangle to match. And this one goes, let's see, right there. Great job. And this one here looks like a rectangle. So let's find the rectangle. Is it here? Let's see. Hmm, that's not right. We got this one wrong. But that's okay. You just try again when you get something wrong. And maybe you'll get it right. Look, we found the rectangle. And this one fits right there. Now we have a square. And the square matches with this one over here. Let's just slide it in and put it in our pan. This one must be a hexagon. Great job! And the hexagon can go right here. Oh, and here we have my favorite shape. It's a star. Everybody is a star in my book. So let's find the shape to go with this one. And the star matches our star cupcake. So it goes right there. And our last shape is a diamond. Perfect! Now it's time for everybody to get a cupcake. I think we should match the colors with the colors of our Paw Patrol friends. What color is Chase? Blue. He's blue, that's right. Let's find a blue cupcake. Here we go. Here's a blue cupcake. I think we should add some pretend icing. Let's use this blue Paw Patrol bath paint. And now for some sprinkles. Ooh, yummy, these are rainbow sprinkles. All right, Chase, try your cupcake. All right. Mmm, so good. And next up is Marshall. Marshall is our red fire pup. I'm fired up. Let's find Marshall a red cupcake. Here's one here. See, the red cupcake matches the red on his hat. 
And we have some red Marshall bath paint to go on it. Oh, that's a lot of icing. And for Marshall, you've got these sprinkles here. Mmm, these look good. There you go, not too much. All right, Marshall, try your cupcake. All right, it looks delicious. Oh, you made a mess. Yummy. My turn, my turn. Okay, Rubble, you get a cupcake next. Rubble is yellow, so he gets a yellow cupcake. Here's one. Oh, it looks yummy. Now it's time for Rubble's icing. And some sprinkles. Oh, these are pretty silver ones. All right, Rubble, it's time to dig in. You got it. Mm-mm. And now it's time for our sky. Sky is pink. So let's find the pink cupcake. This one is pink, just like sky. Oh no, Sky! we don't have any pink icing. Aw, but I really want pink icing. Don't worry, we'll make some. All we have to do is mix some red bath paint with some white bath foam and we'll get pink. Let's try it. First, let's add some red. And now for the bath foam. Now let's take a little bit of red and mix in some bath foam. Whoa, it's turning pink instantly. That's so cool. Wow, we have pink frosting. And now we'll just brush it on like this. Perfect. And now we can add our sprinkles. I think Sky would like these pearl colored ones. Aren't they cool? This pup's gotta eat. Oh my gosh, you have a mess on your face. <laughs> now it's time for Rocky. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Rocky is green, so he gets the green cupcake. And look at this, the green bath paint has a picture of Sky on it. That's silly because Sky is pink. Rocky is green. Here you go, Rocky. And I think Rocky really likes chocolate, so let's give him some chocolate sprinkles. Okay, Rocky, make sure to clean your plate. I won't waste anything. Oh, that's the yummiest cupcake I've ever had. Zuma, are you ready to dive in? You bet. Let's get Zuma an orange cupcake. And I see one right here. That's cool. Oh no, we have the same problem as we did with Sky. We don't have any orange icing, but we can make some by mixing red with yellow. Now remember, when you're making orange, you only want a little bit of red and a lot of yellow. So let's start with a lot of yellow. Put it over here. And add just a little bit of red. See, look, it's turned orange. That's pretty cool. Now let's brush it onto his cupcake. Awesome. And now for some sprinkles. Whoa, these look really cool. Let's add them to the top. Whoa, that's too much. Oh well. I love lots of sprinkles. Oh, perfect, Zuma. This is orange-erific. And our last Paw Patrol pup is Everest. And she is teal. So let's find the teal cupcake for her. Here it is, right here. 
Did you know that teal is a mix between blue and green? So let's make some icing for her. Let's start by adding some blue and some green. And let's start mixing them up. Let's take some of this blue here. Whoops. Starting to turn teal, but it's a little dark. Maybe we can lighten it up with some bath foam. Let's add a little bit right here and see if that helps. Oh, look at that, it's lightening it up. And now we have our teal, which is between blue and green. And now to brush it on the cupcake. There we go. And now we can add some rainbow sprinkles that are in the shape of circles. Oh, we made a mess again. All right, Everest, try that cupcake. Is it good? Yeah, it's delicious. Perfect, I'm so glad that you liked it. Well guys, we fed all the pups, but we still have one more cupcake. Who are we missing? Maybe it's Ryder. It is, he still needs a cupcake. Oh no, the cupcake we have is purple, but Ryder is blue, red, and white. What are we gonna do? <gasps> I know, blue and red make purple, and then we can add white bath foam on top. Does that sound great, Ryder? That's a great idea. Let's start by adding some blue and some red. And now let's mix the two together and see if we get purple. like we need some more red. And just keep mixing it. Look at that, awesome. Now to add it on Ryder's cupcake here. And now let's top it off with some white bath foam. Oh, it kind of looks like Cool Whip. All right, Ryder, give it a try. Oh my goodness, Ryder, you made a mess. But it's worth it because that was so yummy. Wow, look at all the delicious cupcakes we made for the Paw Patrol. Remember, they're only pretend and not for real eating, okay? Hey, what happened to all the cupcakes? Romeo, you should have shared when you had the chance. But I thought being bad was cool. Nope, it's not. Genevieve's Playhouse! <laughs> Whoa, look at this super awesome Pororo school bus! It's even got all of Pororo's friends! Oops, it's kind of heavy! See, there's more on this side too! And there's Pororo up front! Let's open up the left side and meet some of Pororo's friends! Here's Eddie the fox! He's really smart and loves to invent things! Eddie is orange! Now for Loopy. Loopy is a shy and sensitive pink beaver who loves to cook. Loopy is pink. Oh look, it's Krong the dinosaur. He can play the trumpet. Krong is green. Oh, it's Poby. I love Poby. He's a gentle polar bear who plays the drums. Poby is white. Here's all the friends on the left side of the bus. Now let's take a look at the right. Here's Rody the yellow robot. 
He's super strong and a loyal friend. Rhodey is yellow. Oh, how cute! It's Harry the Hummingbird. He loves to sing, and Harry is purple. Whoa, it's Tong Tong the Dragon. He has magical powers that don't always go as planned. Tong Tong is brown. And here's Petty the Penguin. I think Petty and Pororo like each other, but they're both too shy to admit it. Petty has a purple coat. Okay, we're missing someone. There he is. Come on out, silly. Yay, it's Pororo. Pororo is a penguin that can play the electric guitar, and he is blue. Hey, look, what's this? It came with another figure that we can make into anyone we want. I have an idea. Let's make Genevieve one of Pororo's friends. Look, we'll just use a round sticker. And it's Genevieve! I think she needs a little bling though, so let's add one of these gems. Genevieve likes pink, so I'll use one of these and put it on her shirt. So cool! Do you like it, Genevieve? Yes, I do! Genevieve wants to show us something. I wonder what it is. Poby go down the slide? Okay. Whee! Whoa! Now it's my turn! Ah, be careful, Harry! Whee! Whoa! Should it be this way go down the slide? Oh, it's an itch. I get this. Whee! Was that fun, Genevieve? Yes, I did. I got around. Oh, that is so fun. Wait, let's put everybody back in the box. Okay, that's a good idea. Let's put Jamie away here, Rick. Can you close the bus up? There's the other side. Let's go. It's ten. You want to count the ten? One. One. Two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, 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 nine, nine, and ten. ten. Good job, guys. Great job, guys. Let's open it in the window. Let's play crown the dinosaur. Right here, our friend. We'll put a plant here in the box. If he gets loopy, he wants a coat. Let's see, loopy. Loopy. A friend. Can you help? There you go. You want to close the window and get the other side? Yeah! Three equals four. Four. Good job. Let's open the window. Okay. Now it's my turn. Tom Tom the dragon. Yellow robot. Sit down. That's not play time. It's not playtime, it's time to get on the bus. Very hard. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video and always remember, you are awesome. That was fun. It's Jennifer.
Naveen's Playhouse. <laughs> what color car is that? Green. Green? Here you go. Alright, watch. Turn it on. Put that over. Isn't that cool? What color car is that? Blue! Blue? Here you go. How about what color car is that? Red! Red? Good job. What color car is that? Yellow! Here you go. It's going faster. It's going faster? What color car is that? Orange! Orange? Let's take that blue car out. It's getting stuck. Okay. What color car is that? Uh, black. Black? This car's too big. Yeah, it's too big. It's got stuff. So, it's the look in here and then it's the stuff. It's the round here. Yeah, I got stuck. I'll put the black one on. What color is this? White. Good job. Yeah, it has orange on the bottom and blue on the top. I know. Wow. Put the white one on. Evie, what color car is that? Apple. Good job. I'm going up the ramp. Yeah, go up the ramp. And go wait your turn. Okay. Go wait your turn. What color car is this one? Brown. Brown. There you go. Good job. What color is this car? Pink. Good job. Pink. Which color do you want to do last? The gray. The gray? Okay, this one. All right, Evie, it's the last one. What color is that? Gray. Good job. Here it comes. It crashed. Oh, don't get stuck. There you go. Whoa! Here they go. Alright, we're down to the last few cars. And yellow. Is that everybody? Is that all the cars? Great job. Was that cool? Yeah. That was a lot of fun. Say bye, everybody. Bye. Hope you had fun. Hey, guys. Look at these cool toys we have. We have one, two, three cool toys to play with today. Let's start with the Sesame Street one. Look at how cool it is. It's got one, two windows, a door, and a trash can. I wonder if there's something in that trash can. And we can open each one up with these one, two, three, four buttons. 
Let's start with this window. What color is it? Green. That's right, green. And it's got a green button with a yellow rubber ducky. I wonder if that's a clue to who's behind. It's Ernie, and Ernie loves rubber duckies, so that was a clue. Our next door is blue, and it has a cool fish bowl. But we don't push it like the other button, we have to slide it. Let's try that. Whoa, it's Elmo, one of my favorite Sesame Street characters. Okay guys, can you guess who's behind the orange door? It has a cookie for a button, and it says cookie monster. I wonder who it could be. It's Cookie Monster, did you guess right? And we have one more button and it's got Slimy the Inchworm. Let's see, we don't push it, we don't slide it, maybe we turn it. There's Oscar, hey Oscar. Hello. Don't be a grouch, Oscar. Okay. I think we should put all of our Sesame Street Pals back and try it one more time real fast. Let's see, Oscar, Cookie Monster, Elmo and Ernie. Can you count along? One, two, three, four. All right, that was a lot of fun. Let's play with our next toy. I know you guys at home want to play with this race car set, and I do too, but we're going to save them for last, and first we're going to do the dinosaur eggs. Our first egg is purple, and it has a green circle, and the button is a purple circle. Let's press it. Whoa! It's an orange dinosaur with purple circles. Now it's time to do the yellow egg. Let's slide it. Whoa, cool, it's a green dinosaur. I wonder what kind of dinosaur is inside our orange egg with a yellow triangle. Let's find out. Whoa, cool, it's a yellow dinosaur. Can anyone tell me what color this egg is? Green. Green, good job, guys. And it's got a star to match the brown star on the egg. Let's turn the button. And our last dinosaur is purple. Can anyone think of any other dinosaurs that are purple? Hmm. All right, guys, I'm so excited because now we get to play with our car set. Let's take a look at these cars. Here's a red one, and look. They've got circles for helmets to come off. That's really cool. This car is red, and it has the number one on it. This car is green, and it has the number two on it. And our last car is blue, and it has Number three. All right, let's put them in their garages. First, we need to find out where these helmets go. This one is red and has the number one. Should we put it here? No, that's green and has the number two. What about here? No, that's blue and has the number three. So that means it goes here in the red number one, just like our helmet, red one. How about this one? Where should we put the green number two? Let's put it here. That's not right. How about we put it right here with the green two? Good job, guys. All right, our last one is blue with the number three. So that means it goes here. All right, now that we put the helmets away, let's put the cars in their garages. First up is the blue car, and it goes in the blue garage. There we go, let's close the door. All right, we got two more cars left. Next up, we have the, hmm, what color car is this? Red. Red, that's right, it's red, and it goes in the red garage. And finally, we have the green car. The green car goes in our green garage here. All right. Are you guys ready to find out what happens when we give our helmets a little tap? Let's try the red number one. Whoa, cool, the cars come out of the garage. All right, let's try the green number two. And finally, let's try the blue number three. Let's try all three at once. Oh no, watch out, Paw Patrol. It's Genevieve's Playhouse. <laughs> Which one do you want to play with, Evie? Uh, this one. This one, the cars? Yeah. Okay. 
Ooh. Oh, be careful. Okay. The little guy. What color is that one? Um, red. And what color is that one? Blue. What about that one? Green. Good job. Can you hit him? Oh, no. Oh, let's try it. Whoa. <laughs> you want to hit the blue one? red. That car is red, that's right. No, it's number two. Yay! Good job. Look how cute. It gets that clean up. Oh. Whoa. How many cars are they? Uh, three. Three cars. You want to play with that one? Yeah. Let's play with Cookie Monster and Sesame Street. Who do you think is behind this window? Um, Ernie. <laughs> It is Ernie, good job. <laughs> what about this one? What color window is that? Blue. Who do you think's behind that door? Um, Elmo. You think it's Elmo? Let's see. <gasps> oh, so cute. I like, oh, Cookie Monster is stuck. Uh-oh, get him out. <gasps> oh, it's Cookie Monster. Hi, Cookie Monster. <laughs> Who do you think's in the trash can? Oscar. Oscar, let's find out. Turn the inchworm. <gasps> Oscar, crash! <laughs> Here, close them all. Yeah. That's a good one. That was a good one. One, two, three, four. Good job. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. Hi. Can you open up the orange egg? <laughs> good job. Oh. Hi. A birthday jean. Can you open up the green egg? Ooh, good job. Hi. Hi. Secret What's left? And octagon. The hexagon. <gasps> hexagon. Hi. Hi. Did you all pop out of an egg? Yeah. Roar. Roar. Oh, I cookie monster. <laughs> ah! I will wish. Ah! And we have a ducky. Bye bye. Bye bye. I might get to see soon. I'm gonna tell you. Bye bye. Oh my gosh, guys, look at what we have to play with today. It's the Super Auto Tamika building made by Takara Tommy. And it is huge. Just look at how tall it is. It's got an automatic elevator that brings the cars up and lets them ride all the way down the track and start over again. And when the car runs out of gas, they just fill up at the filling station. They can race out of the garage and they even have these cool Lego looking figures that you can collect as well. But today we are gonna play with these cars. Let's open it up, put it together and start playing. Whoa, this is huge. It has tons of stickers too. All right guys, that's everything out of the box. Let's see if we can put it together. Even though the elevator is battery powered, it comes with a little tower top, so you can do it with your finger. Just snap it on, and you can turn the elevator that way. Pretty cool. Now let's attach this two lane ramp. It snaps on just like this. That's really easy. From the back, we can attach the three straightaway pieces. One, two, and three. Now let's use this curve to loop the track back around to the front. Before we put on all the stickers, it's important to remember some rules before we play. Don't put your hand in the elevator. Don't scream at the car. Don't do what it's telling you to do over here. And most importantly, don't sit on it. All right, now that we know our rules, we should be able to put our stickers on. Here's a Tamika sticker for the signpost. A helipad for helicopters to land on. And look, it even has a shopping mall on the bottom floor. All right guys, we're down to our last four stickers. One for each floor of the tower. The bottom floor, or the ground floor, is the first floor. Next is the second floor. 
Above that is the third floor. And finally, the last floor and the highest floor up is the fourth floor. Whoa, guys, take a look at what we built. It looks so cool. But wait, where are all the cars? Hey, I hear something. All right, here's some cars to play with. Can you guys help me unload the truck and figure out what color each car is? Yeah! Now that we've unloaded our truck, let's take a look at our cars and then send them up the track. Our first car is a green SUV and it's got police written on the side. This must be a police car. And next up, we have a red Daredevil sports car. And you can see it's got little Daredevil horns on it. It's got a metallic red windshield. This is a really cool car. And next we have a car with the number four on it. That must mean that this is a race car and it goes really fast. This car is white. Next to that one is a convertible with no top here and it is yellow. And the last car on the truck is a hot rod that's purple. And it's actually kind of transparent here because you can see through it. And wow, look at how big these wheels are. That's crazy. All right, let's send these guys up the track. First, let's turn it on. Here comes the yellow Cobra. Whoa, look at it go. It's going so fast. That's really cool. All right, how about we add some more cars to the track? Now let's watch them all go. Here comes the green SUV. And now the red Daredevil car. Here come more cars headed for the elevator. This car tower is really fun to watch, but now it's time for the cars to come down the ramp. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Time to give some gas to the truck. Here we go. Look, 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 look. Awful. Well, that was a lot of fun playing with five cars, but we've got room for 10 more. Where are we gonna get 10 more cars? Hey, oh my goodness, guys. It's Mac from Disney's Cars. Whoa, cool guys. Let's take a look at the cars that Mac brought us to play with. Whoa, look at all these cars. Let's take a look at the cars that Mac brought us. First up is this Ford GT sports car. And it is blue. So cool looking. And next we have, what is this? This looks like Tigger. He looks like a Tsum Tsum. It is Tigger and he is orange and he's made to look like a van. That's really cool. And next we have an airport shuttle bus and it is gray. And next to that is a green race car with the number three on it. Whoa, that was really fast. Oh, and what's this? This looks like the Batmobile. Isn't that cool looking? This is black. And now we have, whoa, this is a really long car called a limousine. And it is brown. What's this color? Hmm, I think this is gold. See how shiny that is? That's a really pretty color. And the last car that Mac brought us is this flat looking race car that's a light blue. It almost looks like a surfboard. Whoa, it's fast too. 
All right, Mac, thanks for bringing all these cars. Now we're gonna put them on the track. Let's hit the road. All right, let's start sending our cars down the track. Here they come. And now let's turn it on. Whoa, look at all those cars go. That was a lot of fun guys, but now it's time to switch the track and let the cars off. Wow guys, even with our eight extra cars, we still have room for two more. Where are we gonna find two more cars? Well, what's this? Lightning McQueen and Sheriff were racing. I believe I won. Yeah, well, you were speeding, so you're gonna get a speeding ticket. Oh no, I can't have another ticket on my record. Is there anything else I can do? Well, there is one thing. You want me to jump in this hot water? Yup, that'll get you out of this ticket. But it's so high up. Just do it, don't even think about it. Okay, here I go. Whoa! Oh wow, he turned yellow. <laughs> you yellow bellied rust bucket. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Look at that. They fell in the hot water and changed color. Stop talking about it, man. Just get us out of here. Okay, okay. I got you. Here's Sheriff and Lightning McQueen. We finally got all 15 cars for our parking deck. Great job, guys. But who wants to see a race? In lane number one, we have the white number four race car. And in lane number two, we have the number three green race car. All right, guys, place your bets. Who do you think is going to win? Three, two, one, go. I think the white race car won. All right, I did it. Yay, I won. Yeah, but you were both speeding. Aw. Wah, wah, wah. Whoa, guys, check out all these cool cars and vehicles we have to play with today. We have this really cool race car vehicle set with these super fast race cars. We have an emergency vehicle set that even comes with a helicopter. And this super cool community vehicle set. And last but not least, we have a construction vehicle set as well. All these cars and vehicles are from Melissa and Doug and they are super fun and fast. Let's play with them. It's Genevieve's Playhouse. <laughs> all right, I'm ready to play with the... What happened? Where are all the drivers for the vehicles? We can't play with the cars until we find the drivers. Here they all are, in this jar here. We need to get them out and put them with the right car. All right, first up we have... This guy. He has the number four and he has a race car outfit on. So which car do you think he drives? I think he drives this car. This car is the blue number four race car. And this is the blue number four race car driver. Vroom, vroom. Now this car is ready to roll. Awesome job, guys. Let's find drivers for the other cars. All right, next up, we have... It's the police officer. Hmm. What car does the police officer drive? I think he drives this car right here. The blue and white police car. Here you go, police officer. In your car. Next we have this lady. 
She looks like she has a school bus driver outfit on. Let's find the school bus. Here it is. Here's the yellow school bus for the school bus driver. And it even has a red stop sign just like a real school bus to help kids cross the street safely. In you go. Our next driver is... It's the number three race car driver. See, he has a race car outfit on with a helmet to keep him safe. And he's got the number three. Let's find the number three race car. Here it is. Whoa, this car looks so fast. It's green with the number three. So here you go, number three race car driver. Are you ready for the big race? Yeah, let's go. Mm. Next up we have a construction worker with a red vest and a red helmet. I'll bet he drives a cement truck. This truck is red and has an awesome spinning cement tank that mixes all the ingredients inside so we can make cement out the back. Here you go construction worker, in your cement truck. Our next driver is going to be this woman. She has a green jumper on and she has a symbol on her vest. What's that symbol mean? It means recycle. I'll bet she drives a recycle truck. Here it is right here and look, it's got the recycle symbol just like her shirt. That means we found the right truck. This truck is green because it helps save the environment. Here you go, in your recycle truck. Our next driver is this lady, she has green scrubs on. Green scrubs are worn by doctors. That means she drives the ambulance. Here it is right here. See, it even has the same symbol as on her shirt. This car is an ambulance and it's white. It helps people when they get hurt. So let's put her in so she can help save people. Get out of the way, everyone. Here comes an ambulance. All right, who's next? We got the mailman. Hi, mailman. He's even got a letter in his hand. Let's find the postal truck. Here's the postal mail truck. It's white with blue stripes and an envelope on it, just like the envelope in his hand. So he's gonna send some letters. Now we're gonna get the... Oh, it's the orange construction worker. He's got an orange vest and an orange helmet. I'll bet that means he drives the orange tractor here. Look, it even has lifting arms for scooping up dirt and moving rocks out of the way. Isn't that cool? I really like this tractor. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Tractors are really strong. Vroom. All right, let's see who we get now. It's the red number one race car driver. He's got on his racing suit. He's got the number one. Let's get his race car. Here it is. This car is red. Just like the red on his jumpsuit. Here you go, race car driver. Vroom. Whoa, that was fast. We've only got a few more drivers left. We got... This is the tow truck driver. Look, he's got a red shirt on and a wrench just in case someone breaks down and he can help tow him if he can't fix it. Here's the tow truck with his arm that attaches to a car and he pulls it away to safety. Here you go, tow truck driver. All right, now for another driver. Oh, who's this? He has a blue and orange jumpsuit on and he's got the letter H, which means helicopter. He drives the orange helicopter which flies in the sky instead of rolling on the ground. See, it doesn't even have wheels. It has propellers that keep it in the air. All right, let's put the pilot inside and he can fly his helicopter. Off it goes. All right, guys, we got three more drivers left. Let's see. This is a fireman. He drives the fire truck to help put out fires. Whoa, isn't that cool? It's got a ladder, it's a bright, bright red, so you can see it in the street. And it's even got a water hose on top. 
Isn't that awesome? Here you go, fireman. Make sure there's no fires. All right, once we put our last two drivers in, we can play with our vehicles. This one is the blue construction worker. Look, she's got a hard hat on and a blue vest. I'll bet she drives the dump truck. Isn't that cool? It's blue and yellow. And the bucket lifts up and down to help dump stuff out. All right, here you go. In the dump truck you go. All right guys, we have one car left missing a driver. Can you guess which one's still missing a driver? Let's see if you got it right. It is the number two race car driver. Did you guess correctly? She has the number two and a yellow race car jumpsuit on. And here is her race car. Awesome. This car is yellow and looks really, really fast. Vroom. All right, guys, that was a lot of fun. If you like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And make sure you subscribe to see all of our fun videos. Bye, guys.